I'm going to show you how to put the gearbox together. Here's a frame for the gearbox. I've got my first four gears and then the final one with this shaft is the output stage. First thing to do is to make sure that your gears move um, quite freely on a three millimeter screw. Make sure it's loose. If it isn't, it's a good idea to take a drill. Just make sure it's clear in there. First I'm going to start on this side here, drop in two of the gears and for these gears you're going to put your orientation of the, of the uh, bolt is going to go through like this, it takes a little bit of wobbling to get things to go through and then the nut goes on the end opposite the, the motor. I won't bother tightening that too much now. Then we're going to do this side where we have three stages including the output. Now on this one the bolt actually starts by going into the output shaft that actually sits inside there. Again wiggle things around, find the holes like this oops not getting my screw on there It's a good idea to put a bit of thread locker on the end of the nuts after you've tightened them up. And they actually shouldn't be done too tight. You don't want to grip and start squeezing in the plastic so things should be free to move. And there you can see that everything's turning as it should. Um, we've got the final um, chain drive gear here. It looks a bit like a uh, shuriken. And there's actually a flat on this that has to line up with a flat on the output shaft so I'm going to push that in like that. Uh, I would, I'm would. i not going to push that all the way on because I'm going to make sure things are tightened but once you've got everything tightened and locked in place you push that all the way on and that's the gears assembled.